Yeah! Station assembled. Oh yeah, look. An, a saw and an axe, the pinwheel. Hello guys, Zuljan here and welcome back to another episode of Crashlands. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Thank you so much for all the amazing support on the Crashlands series. Guys, as always, me and Cutie Patootie really appreciate it. If you like the videos, guys, don't forget to give me some dap on that like button to show you support for the series. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. So, last time we beat that boss... We got some essence that we really needed for the big net to embig and glowy. So that's what we're going to do right, right, right now. Let's go over to the ship. Oh, man. It's been a day or so since I played Crashlands. I had bulk recorded a little bit and uh, I missed it. <laughs> I really did miss it. Okay. Glowy. Oh, wait. I guess we have to... Um Hold on, we have to... I guess we have to put her up. Okay, Glowy, come here. I have to make this thing for you, girl. Um, I don't know if you're a girl, by the way, Glowy. I don't know. I just kind of thought about that. Maybe it's in this new thing. Yeah, uh, wait. This... No. This thing... This, there it is. <laughs> wow, so hard. All right, we can make one. Wow, that took a lot of materials. But it's okay. We needed it. So, Glutternet. Glutterflies go crazy for this kind of crime. I mean, Biggins, your Glutterfly to a powerful size. So, like I said, there were uh, we we got we got kind of stomped the last few times. Especially Glowy wasn't doing a whole bunch, um, but Cutie Patootie was helping out huge. So as soon as that is available, we should be good. It's at a bad place too. Maybe I should move the um. Maybe I should move where Cutie Patootie's at. I'm just going to stay in this darn menu until I get it. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Got it. Glutternet. All right. Are y'all ready? It's gonna happen. We ready? Here we go. What? Glowy's growing. So yeah! <laughs> oh yeah! Glowy's fat now. <laughs> Look at that pause. Oh, wait. She didn't get too big. Come here. What? Come here, Glowy. What? Hold on, hold on. You can cast light? Oh, oh, you can close the door. Wait, what was that all about? There was a flashlight of some sort. What is this all about? What? Missing required hive lighter. Ah, that's the next one, I guess. All right. Uh, and what are we missing here? A Wampogo stick. Ah, I guess we got to do something else. Okay, we're grabbing Glowy, though. She's going to come. Oh, by the way, what can we pick up with Glowy? Can we do anything else with her? No, it's still this dust right here, but we're going to go ahead and build them while we can. All right, guys, we got all of the Glutterfly dust or whatever that we needed. Now it's time to do the rest of the quests. Uh, if we go to data right here, we saw that last time we, we talked with Derned about symbolizing Burl's uh, life or whatever, and we have to give, uh, I think it's a potted sunshroom to... Um, to grandmammy so let's take a look i think the stone shaper is what we need is this the stone shaper yeah and we should have a potted sunshroom available yes we can build one also you guys have been talking about me making potted plants in general so i'm gonna make a couple more of those that way you can we can kind of harvest them as we go another thing is we'll take a look at this as well and we can get the potted bacon weed was that this or was that another thing no that was all we already checked that the potted bacon weed must have been here yeah so we do need some bacon weed to make that happen and we'll have to get some while we're out but right now what wait cutie patootie i gotta get some stuff out of here b no i don't need no you can't come with me right now okay fine come with me right now just so i can get here hold on put her in there 
We're going to take... You come out, Glowy. All right. Now, can I actually... I need to move that thing. Okay. We got two of the potted sun shrooms. Let's go ahead and place those, shall we? If I take... Uh, let's see. Probably build mode, huh? Probably build mode. I just pressed the wrong key right there. Let's go to infinity. There we go. And we'll only put two of these. I guess we can put them right here and right here. And they'll just grow. I don't know if you need to fertilize them or anything. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, we got the potted sun shroom back. Fine. Okay, we are ready to go, I believe. Let's go. Let's take a shortcut to Grandmammy's. And maybe all we have to do is just give it to her. Ah, she does have a quest icon now. Hey, Grandmammy. Why, hello there, young flower. You're quite the peddly one, aren't you? And a metal talk box. How cute. Would you like to come in for some fish? Fishing's good around these parts. Grandmammy, uh, we're actually here to say I've got a grandson who would love to meet a flower like you. He ran off with the darn, <laughs> that darn dern a while back, though. I would like it if he visited me. Uh... I would like that so much. Ahem. I'm sorry, Grandmammy, but Burl passed away. The floating head, who could do, killed him. What? That ain't possible. Flowery, if Burl was dead, then someone would be here bearing his root, along with the symbol of his life. Sorry, we're the ones bearing it. Oh, my. He died helping others, Grandmammy. Twas just like little Burl to do that. Always putting others first. Thank you for bearing his root to me. I owe you a favor on account of you doing this deed for me and my family. A favor? Anything you need, Flowery, to celebrate Burl's life and so on so my grief may be put to good. Grandmammy, we're in need of a battery. Do you know where we might find one? Tech ain't my strong suit, but the old friend Graham runs a lab in a good distance from here. He might be able to help you find what you be needing, but be careful wandering that far out. The glutterflies are real bad at night. Now, I need a moment to think on Burl. Flowery, this floating head done wronged me, and I cannot let this stand. All right, so Graham's, la Graham's laboratory, and I'm pretty sure we have that. Uh, vengeance, but vengeance is the best dish served with a side of breakfast food. Flux, she's freaking out a little. Her stare is boring a hole into the wall. Bro always loved omelets. Tell you what, Flowery, whip me up an anger omelet I could use to bout now. Wait, two about now. You need a hearth to tend it. If you need some stones, you can sometimes find big patches out in the middle of the lakes. Okay, so we did get a new thing here. Anger omelet. Okay, we'll need to learn how to discover that. And what is this? This is a hearth. Okay, so that's a new thing that we can build in the stone shaper. Cool. Uh, let's take a look at... And we can go to Graham's laboratory. We've already been there, too. Thankfully, exploring kind of helps when you're just going uh, wild like that. All right, uh, where are we? We have to go to the right here. No, leave me alone, Tatai. Leave me alone, I said, you big Tatai. Okay, Graham's laboratory is where? Oh, it's way to the right over there. I was actually, I'm actually too far away from it. That was where I fought that other thing. Oh, no, stop. I can't open the map when I'm in combat. Okay. Graham's laboratory is a little bit to the left here. Aha! Uh -huh. This is where we needed to go. Yes, he has quest dialogue now. Very good. Very good. What have you got to say there, Graham? Hopefully something good. I want that chest that's behind you. Huh? What? Graham. Grandmammy sent us over. We need bait. No time for talking with these glutterflies closing in, stranger. I don't see any glutterflies around, uh, except for Glowy here. Graham, you okay? You look like you're in shock. You got here between waves, didn't you? Didn't hold out for days. I lost my poor intern, Lana. Hear that? The buzzing? They're coming. Oh, boy. All right, this shouldn't be that bad. Shouldn't be that bad. Oh, Glowy's gonna help out too. Wow. Okay. Glowy, I need help. After I eat my sunshroom. Okay, we ready? No, not quite. We're still taking damage. Get a Glowy. Get a Glowy. Get a Glowy. I think I'm gonna die. I think I'm gonna die. I think it's all over. Oh. Ghost is clear. I'm coming out. 
Apparently we, we said, oh, I ate a centrum. Perfect. Okay, wait. The big one wasn't in that group and still ain't no sign of Lana. The big one? Just how big? The buzzing. Oh no, she's burrowing in. Oh gosh, queen of the glitters. Get her, Chloe! Chloe's gonna get her. Oh no, don't let it hit me. All right, there's three. Get her, Chloe! Is Glowy doing damage? Yes, Glowy is doing damage. Glowy, finish her! Ooh. Lana! Spits profusely. I feel like I was in this inside of one of them party sacks. <laughs> Lana, I'm so happy you're back. Doing right. Ahem, we solved your bug problem. How about helping us out? Right, I suppose a favor uh, is owed. <laughs> what you needin'? <laughs> We're looking for a battery to complete our communications device. Grandmammy said that you might know a thing or two. Bah, I can't help you with that. Energy arts and all. But I have a friend, a Master Smith's, uh, Master Squeeze Smith, Ramaro, who dabbled in energy arts before. Okay. She lives over yonder in a big pond, always was a bit of a loon, and she likes the solitude. Uh, you may want to bring her a bauble of some sort. She's known to get a bit surly with people interrupting her i suppose you're right lana here build one of them pinwheels for her and the, from the kim works before you talk to her you might want you might need to spend some time fighting butterflies for the parts better safe than sorry when we're talking about energy arts user okay so we have some more schematics this is the pointy pinwheel oh, and it looks like we also have a new table yes kim works okay so we need to talk to both of them. Okay, one of them poisons like a glitter or maybe some bump berries. Apply it as coating on some projectiles and then boom, fling at the things. Poison jectile? Brilliant. If we help you make the first one, will you share the recipe with us? Heck yeah, there's a patch of bump berries due south of here. I mark them with the roots so we can find them at each harvest. The only problem is there are big, fat, wampin' bulga hanging around them. You take bulga down and bring me them berries and we can get to work. Okay, that's a new quest. And this one ought to be a new one too. Psst, purpley. I got, I got a bit of a problem I'm needing solved with some of that alien discretion of yours. Flux here doesn't work for cheap. You better have a reward or two or I'm more down the line. Right, right, of course. I'll give you access to my chest in, in the back if you do this for me. Ooh, I want that chest, yes. See? The Deglare Queen you just up and destroyed? It's got a bigger, meaner sister. How do you know about this? And why are the Glutterflies trying to kill you in the first place? Well, see, I tried to domesticate one. <laughs> and by that, I mean I saw a huge one, tossed a poorly made saddle on it, and leapt on it. Didn't go well. <laughs> you tried to ride an enormous Glutterfly? Look, scientifically, it seemed a good idea at the time. But now we won't stop trying to bust in here. Till you came along... <laughs> I thought I done caused Lana up here to die. I think if you take out the Glutterfly I tried to saddle, they'll leave me be. The old brute Explodorius is due south of here. Better be some good stuff in that chest, Graham. Okay, so we got a bunch of things to kill, but first, I think I want to go home and check out this new cool, um, this new cool work table station thing that we made. We're going to have to extend the house pretty soon, too. So let's see what we can do here. We can make floors all along. There's plenty of floors that I can make. Uh, but we don't necessarily need to do that right now. I just want to get on to making stuff. Uh, let's do... Let's see what we have to make. First, we're going to have to make the Kim works. So we need to go to the Stone Shaper. And we need to select Kim works. To do that, we need bum berries, of course. Uh, we have everything else, though, which is a good thing. Uh, so we'll go ahead and track that. Let's go down to the bump berry patch, or around here. We're not going to specifically see that. There's a bump berry right there. How many did we need? One. We need three altogether, which should be very, very easy to get. Also, sun shrooms, man. Whew. I got to eat some. All right. Where, pray tell, is the bump berries? There we go. There's another one. All right, we'll only need one more. I know we're gonna need more in general altogether, right? But I'm not gonna harvest that that many right now. Not without knowing what we need exactly from the Kim Works. So we can build the Kim Works now. Let's build it. 
All right. Hopefully, we can make some really, really cool armor and maybe weapons with this, man. Typically, when we get a workstation, we get new stuff. Like this time, we got this nice orange armor and this hammer and stuff for flatstone. Um, hopefully, maybe some even some new tools to harvest some of those new resources. What we got here? Yeah! Station assembled. Oh, yeah, look. An, a saw and an axe. The pinwheel. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so now we need to place this. Let's go in build mode and place the Kim Works. We could do it, uh, I don't know, we'll do it right there. Okay. And let's check it out. Okay, pinwheel, we can make it already. Well, that's awesome. We'll go ahead and build it. And what is this? Plastic? An initially soft substance becomes extremely hard over time. That's a component. Uh, oh, we can get a glitopus, a glitopus, glitopus incubator. Uh, but we need a glitopus egg first. Uh, so we'll have to probably kill some gunpowder. <laughs> Spelt with an A. Uh, this would even be more useful if you had a gun. Yeah. <laughs> um, a blastique saw. Ah, tier two saw. The serrated blastic edges of the saw will tear through squee plants like a knife those through something soft and buttery okay cool and last but not least the stone hawk level five weapon once you read about this in national geographic it seemed effective okay we actually have enough stuff to make a couple of these so i think we're gonna try it let's see if we get a real good one uh first of all and then we're gonna try it out i really hope it's good 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 Almost. I really hope it's good. We'll be able to compare it to our other weapon. It's a tier 5 weapon, so... Alright. Attacks per second, 2. Damage, 142. So, this does attack faster. I hate that we lost our movement speed, but look at the damage increase, man. 142 damage per second. This one's 117, so that's a lot higher. Shock chance, move speed, and stun is what we would lose from that. Uh, we'll equip it for now. We might make another one based on whatever we might need. First of all, though, we're going to need some of this stuff. Water balloon. It squeaks annoyingly when you rub your hands together. What? How do we make water balloons? Um, That's weird. I have no idea how to make that stuff. And, oh, maybe we just need some Blastique first. So, Blastique takes Walker Blossoms. We've gotten a bunch of those already. Why do I keep pressing back? And, what is this? Glitopus Ink. Okay, and we do have some of that as well. So, we can actually make nine of these. Um, let's go ahead and build. And we can we can build some of these. The gunpowder, this, we don't need that yet. Um, Blastique, I thought that was, yes, we need, we have enough for that. So, I don't know how to make water balloons. It's something, wait, how, how is it? Water balloons, water balloons look like, I'm trying to see if there's something in the silhouettes that looks like it, but I don't know. Maybe we have to kill something to get it. I don't know, man. I don't know, but I do want to test out this thing. Oh, seven minutes left on the growth of that sunshroom. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's go test this out on a Glitopus. There should be some around here. All right. 77. Wow. We stuck them pretty hard. Let's get that sunshroom right there. I want to attack this big one. I gotta do it. Ouch. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, get it. Get it, look. They're actually kind of easy to fight. I think Cutie Patootie is going to give Glowy a run for her money, man. Okay, we got more Glitopus ink and Glitopus siphons, but we still didn't get any water balloons. Huh. 
Gonna have to definitely check out there. Maybe we'll get that from one of the other quests that we're gonna do. But anyway, guys, that is gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give me some dap on that like button to show your support for the series, guys. And y'all can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off. And we'll see you next time. Aha! That was good! Oh, I like that. I like that. I like it very much. So big groups of enemies, that is going to come... Uh, that is going to be invaluable, man.